get started we'll do this rather quickly mm -hmm. we want to be able to meet today and just go over some of the uh, plus and deltas from the competition that we had in San Antonio just a few weeks ago on April the 1st mm -hmm. and uh, we just first share the norms quickly you all know our norms we speak courageously and honestly about the content mm -hmm. we uh, make the main point a main point all the time we stick to the rules and you always do a great job at that we want to keep it aspirational as usual with our kids mm -hmm. And we want to make sure that we remain accountable for personal and team actions all the time, which is something that we always do. We just wanted to go over those very briefly. Um, somebody has an iPhone that we can track the time. So we can make sure that we stick to oh, the yeah. time. Okay. Let's give ourselves 10 minutes for the first round. Let's see how, how deep into the meeting we can go. Mm -hmm. And who's going to be my notes keeper? Okay. You, you keep some of the notes. All right, you keep the notes. So let's celebrate first of all. I want to celebrate uh, Malana and the science team. Yeah. That second place at state was really something that was really amazing. I know you you were <laughs> waiting for the scores, and, yeah. and when they went to like you know fifth place, four, third, you didn't hear our school. That sounds good. Great. And you know when you heard it come up with second, I know the guys, were, the kids were really excited about that. But we want to commend you for that, and of course Fernandez and all guys. You know top ten, yeah. top ten by now is sweepstakes, so I think we can. Bump that up next year, but that was an awesome achievement. It was 7th in number sense, 10th in calculator, and 20th in general math. Out of 127. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why I'm, like seven schools. I'm doing nothing but general that's, math that's right enough. now in class. Just to get ready for yeah, that. for next year. And, you know, I think next year, I mean, we should be able to be top five, oh, if yes. not top three. Yes. And that's why we wanted to hold a meeting. I want to be strategic about it so that mm -hmm. we can provide you with the support next year so we can make sure that we can get there. I know that we can get there if all of your time and attention is going towards right. that. Mm -hmm. Instead of all the little things, we definitely can get there. Mm -hmm. So let's look at some of the pluses and we're going to go around to get some feedback from you guys. So oh, what do you think were some of the good things that happened this year? That math and science team have the same schedule period. So we should re re No, I mean this year. This year. The oh. same period. Yeah. Oh, was. just having a class, having an actual having class, class without that was, class. Well, the <laughs> class was focused on, was on uh, math and science. Without that class, you couldn't do anything at all. Yeah. Well, of course, there are good things, support from the parents. Oh, yeah, parents. They, they created a booster club instead oh. of just oh, friends yeah. for loans. Yes, yes. Which yes. make it easy for... We don't students. have to worry about the money at all. It's just... The booster club was just for the math and science team. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's proper. It, yeah, it was the money came very fast and and, and there was never an issue. No, it was no. Never, we never had to worry. And then there's one guy right. who he'll keep on uh, feeding us with money. Uh, the lucky, lucky, lucky Martin from Arnold's uh, family. Or in, yeah, yeah. Is he's the VP over there. Or he something let, like no, that. no, he's he's a he's, he's got a big position over there. He's a big director or something. And I think he mentioned that even though his kid's moving to Woodrow, he's still going to be supporting yeah. the team, right? He moved last year. He wasn't here this year. He, he wasn't here this year. He yeah. already gave us yeah. 3000 mm -hmm. That was that was. Good. And uh, Barnacoat, uh, Ms. Barnacoat, she works for the Frito Lay, I think. Mm -hmm. Frito Lay as well. She gave us a lot of uh, stuff for her. Stuff also. Chips, like a thousand bags of chips for her. Wow. And yeah. she's really, she's helped us a lot, also get donations. Yeah. So, so those are some resources that. No, we should be there next year as well. Mm -hmm. yeah. And your your support, sir, administration. <laughs> support. Oh Without yes, you. sir. Yeah. Thank you. you. We wouldn't have been able yeah. to do yeah. anything. Without you. No. Yeah, I know it was kind of random this year, but I felt like you know, uh -huh. like I, I didn't see any administrator like involved with going. And we like, tried yeah. to. We tried new scheme. We yeah. Tried, but yeah, you know, but you're the one really who gave who us the support. support. <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Yeah, you are a big yeah. into our this program. This is academic, you know, because I figure that. We always talk about what the stuff we can do to get the kids to be commended uh -huh. in the test. It makes sense. And it starts with this kind of motivational program. Like they know they're going to San Antonio, they know they can compete at the state level. And smart kids are really they bought in this one thing is to be commended, it's good for the individual student to want to be commended, but when you have a team involved, the same thing with a basketball team or a softball team. Yeah. You know, when you're competing with some of your friends in the same team, then you have the same experience. Mm -hmm. So we're using the same sports model but with math and science. Okay, 
So those are some of our pluses. Now, when I say delta, we're not talking to tell you what stuff that is negative, but rather stuff that we can that we can do better. Because I think that my idea is that I think that your time is so high leverage. Like when you're with a kid or with kids working, that is so important. But anything that takes away your fo focus from that is something that I want to address. Like I want to be able to allow you guys to just focus on the actual preparation for the testing. And anything else that has to do with getting us to get there is taken care of. Mm -hmm. just, just to give you an example, like we were monitoring the kids, but you had to wake up at 2 a.m. to go monitor some kids in the hallway. <laughs> and you should be able to rest and you work with the kids, you know, when the time comes. And these are things that I want to be able to plan for, like even registering us in the hotel and all those things. I mean, it should be where when you get there, you're just thinking what items that I need to work with to get a better score in the test. But see, that's what I do because Ms. Milana does all the paperwork. <laughs> so I don't worry about the paperwork. I just worry about teaching. And, but she's, she but could see, get, yeah, she had to do all the And all, she got a second the details. Details. Yeah. <laughs> So imagine if she did have She did paper. like a hundred papers. Every time, paper. She was filling yeah, in some new paper. paperwork. Yeah. So as Ms. Milana needs an assistant. So we're looking at uh, yeah, secretary. A logistics assistant. Who can take care of all the little details? So that way, your brain is used for that, you know, instructional piece. Right. But, yeah. that, it, but that one is only for a seasonal. No, we need. Just like. We need no, also no. for the regular competition on regular. Saturdays, but we worry. But even for the yeah for the like the warm ups, the regionals, and all yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. I think my idea would be like having a TA kind of like work with us. Yeah. Uh -huh. On those things, and then you tell them what we need to do, and then they make the phone calls, they make the yeah. they, oh, yes. they coordinate a lot of the Collect stuff. the money that's missing. Yes, oh. Collect the money that's <laughs> oh, We forgot yeah. our biggest plus is Miss Frank. Miss Oh, yeah. yeah, the parent yes. volunteers. Yes. 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 Oh, she was really Miss Frank. Yeah, he likes to ride with her to all the places. So definitely logistics. Okay. Uh, the second is the schedule. We discussed it. The eight, the schedule. We could have it eight period. Eight period? No, no. Yeah. Yeah, one eight period? Yeah. I think it's it, the so if they need to stay, if we need some kids to stay, to for stay more then they can extend. So you have the extra time. We have extra time. Yeah, extra time to. And there will be no conflict for lunch period of six, yeah, seven right. days. But well, what about athletics? Most of my kids are in athletics. Then they have to do good before they will be released. No, they're in athletics. Athletics is the last class of the day. Oh, athletics is eighth period. Oh. Oh, you mean like PE? Yeah. No, the athletics. Yeah, the kids that are in athletics, like uh, year yeah, round, yeah, they, yeah. it's an eighth period. Oh, then seventh period. Do we do it seventh then? <laughs> yeah, seventh. Yeah, seventh good. Yeah, seventh's good. Seven, seven is, is good. good. I say seven. Yeah. Like this lunch thing this year wasn't lunch good. Lunch is not good. So uh, seven would be good. Okay. And then if uh, three classes... Well, unless they keep the schedule because my math team is off seven. I don't know what's going to happen. Because if we increase the number of kids, then... Mr. O do... I'll do the math or... We'll do six grades. Six grades. Six grades? Yeah. yeah. And then you just do eight grades? Seven and eight. Seven and eight? Yeah. yeah. That would be... Because there would be... That would, but that would be an issue of the class schedule, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So, okay. You can have Ordo in six. Six. And then Fernando do... Just seven, seven and eight. And eight. Seven, eight, eight. And maybe we can rotate with this one, with Miss Molana Science, because some of science are also taking math. And our math yeah. so put so on into the rotation of the classes. Yeah, so it would be good, sir. So the but they can't, they can't have two electives. They cannot have. Oh, no, you mean, I mean, oh, they're, they're, because okay. we have the same schedule, okay, we can, can rotate them. Oh, well, they Because some of the math do also science. Like some. what we're doing right oh, okay. now. Okay, like, like what you're doing right now. So, so we're going to keep that. We rotate them. They won't be You want Audrey today? No, thank you. You can do that kind of in four yeah. so we need to for that. Yeah. We'll wrap up in four minutes. But pretty much, we have the process. The logistic assistant schedule part, seven periods being the one for the class. Then breaking it up so you can actually have one class. Six grades have many from the late book now. They have about 30 plus. We have like, no, it was like 100 total between yeah, all the schools. Yeah, recommendations from, from the teachers. From, yeah. from. But we have to look at the scores also, sir. I mean, we really have to get the best, the best, the top. So, so we oh, that's what we want. We, the weak ones out. Weak ones out. Okay. Uh, so, so we do a diagnostic so we can see what the weak ones are. Yeah. Yeah. But we have this, but we need to look at the star scores, ITBS scores. We don't need to get them on another test that we see. You need to, so you just need to look at the, at the look at test. Yeah.
to ensure that most kids are not in your process, like if you have a very, very weak student who needs more support yeah. during training, yeah. then we accommodate them in a different yeah. class. Yeah. Anything else major that we want to throw in there? Yeah. These are yeah. some of our major steps that we can follow up on. So let me work on the system. If you look at the schedule, Dr. Sean, I don't know what the schedule is looking like, I'm sure that you guys are inserting your spot, and we may have a follow-up meeting with Sean on the schedule. And then, if you already have that rotation available, it's a pretty period. Yeah, we have the same period. Oh, you want to keep that. Yes. And then, when we do the schedule with the counselors, make sure that, based on the testing levels, you give them a shot look at the list of the students being in that class. And we can plan that with the counselors. And the summer comes before the... A week before the school starts. Yeah. Okay. Oh. We can say that. Okay, but we can. Ten minutes is up. So. Yeah. Okay. Usually the sixth graders do a camp. All the other right. So we can get them ready. Okay. So I'll look at the availability of all the facilities. I can be here for the boot camp. Yeah. And I'll definitely have somebody from maintenance, so we can we can get it done. Okay. That's not a big. We can open the building and bring them in. Okay. So we can read them out. Read them out. Read them out. Yeah. All right. So. Yeah. We are adjourned. I'll take care of those items. Get back to you guys, and we'll keep working at it. Thank you. Thanks so much. Thank you. Oh, do me a favor, right? When you get a chance with this card, when you get a chance to do the plus and deltas about the meeting. Oh yeah. Okay. Like things that you like. Um, yeah, good luck for Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, guys. So, there will be a follow up meeting to this. Yeah. Okay. So, I have to look forward to the rest of Great. Then you can just email me the notes. Well, if you can take a picture, sir, and email it to us. So, that we, we might have this email. Yeah, I'll take a picture of it right now. Thanks, guys.